North Korea has carried out a successful underwater test of a ballistic missile. The North Korean state news agency reported leader Kim Jong-un oversaw the test himself. KCNA reported on Saturday, a submarine launched the missile at a location far from the North Korean mainland. According to the news agency, Kim praised the test as a miraculous achievement and said his country is capable of producing this type of missile. This missile was a time bomb which will go off on the backs of our hostile enemies at any time, he added. The KCNA report said North Korean leader Kim Jong-un praised the test as a miraculous achievement. According to KCNA, North Korean leader Kim Jong-un praised the test as a miraculous achievement, according to KCNA. Such rhetoric, while alarming on its face, is not unlike Kim's pronouncements after missile tests in the past. North Korea has already allocated a significant portion of its budget to the military, and Saturday's announcement does not necessarily signify a ramping up of military efforts. Daniel Pinkston, Deputy Project Director for Northeast Asia at the International Crisis Group Think Tank, told CNN that, if authentic, the latest missile test would be quite significant since North Korea has been working on these capabilities for decades. If they can deploy an operational submarine that could launch ballistic missiles armed with nuclear warheads, it would give them a pretty credible second strike capability and it's difficult to defend against. So it would give them the kind of deterrent that they have said they wish to have, he said. Everyone knew they had been working on this. I think actual flight test is sooner than people had expected. Also Saturday, a South Korean defense ministry official said North Korea had fired three ship-to-ship -ship missiles from the sea near North Korea's eastern city of Wonsan. No other details were available as of yet, the official said. The missiles were fired in an hour-long window Saturday afternoon local time. The anti-ship missiles are designated KNO-1 type by South Korea, and are not in the same category as the submarine-launched ballistic missile reportedly tested by the North. That launch was from a port farther to the north up the eastern coast of the Korean Peninsula.